Hello, today we're going to be over how to add ads to your sidebar. Uh, these will be rotating images. Um, they could either be, just be rotating images or they can be clickable ads that you're adding to the sidebar. They're not um, Google AdSense or any of those networks, but if you've had an agreement with um, another party to put their ad and you just want it wrote, a couple of them rotating in the sidebar, this is how you're going to do it. This is another tutorial provided by Compete Now. WordPress and e-marketing tutorials that give you the keys to your web presence, putting the fast things to success. Learn more on our website at startcompeting.com slash tutorials. Right, we're going to get started. Um, the plugin that I'm going to use is another plugin I use to show how to do a slider on the home page, but I'm going to show you how you can also use it um, to, to accomplish you know, sidebar rotating the images or just sidebar ads. So let me just we'll see if it's already installed. If you don't have it, it's WP dash cycle. Okay. Alright, so it is installed. But if you don't already have it, that's what you're going to search, and it's by Nathan Rice. And once you do search that, it is. Um, I also put a link in the, in the video description where you can download it directly if you want. Alright, so once that's installed, you're going to have um, on media, there's going to be WP dash cycle. You can click on that. All right, so I only I already have a couple of images in here, and um, so that's fine. But um, to add new images, you're just going to do choose file, and you pick a, a an image off your computer, and you hit upload. And you want to make sure that you upload them in the order that you want the images to rotate in, because with this plugin, you can't drag or drop or um, reorder them after you've already uploaded the images. So you kind of do it. Make sure you do it in the right order. All right. So there's a bunch of different transition effects you can choose from. I always prefer prefer fade. You can play around with that if you want. All right. You can pick your transition. Play, um, how much time each ad shows or each image shows. Uh, and you can pick the length. One is fun. You can usually just use one. Uh, dimensions. So I previously had this in the in the. Um, I could show you. I previously had this type of thing right in the middle of the page. So 500 was pretty good size, but now it's going to be going in the sidebar, which is much smaller. So I'm actually going to get that down to 200 by 150. Oh, by 150. All right, I'm going to save my settings. Once you do that, you're going to go to Appearance and then Widgets. Okay, and then you're going to do go get your text widget. Drop the top one. So I'll say Our Partners. Put in the short code. It's um, WP cycle. Let me just make sure that works before I uh, <laughs> stick by that. Yep, that was it. So that's WP underscore cycle. I also put that in the description. So you notice that as you now have the images rotating in the sidebar. And something I forgot to do was show you how to do the link. It's pretty self explanatory I'm just going to link to my website. And we'll go back to media and then wp-cycle. You can highlight where the image links to. Hit update. Right. Now if I click on that, it's going to go right to the advertisement advertisers website. Now there's no easy way to make it so it opens in a new tab unfortunately. That would require you know getting into the the themes um, code. If you can do that that's great. If not then um, you know it's just not going to be able to open to a new tab unless somebody right clicks it and opens it in a new tab. Alright so whether you're adding ads here for that purpose or whether you just want pictures in your sidebar rotating this is a great way to do it. And um, I hope it helps. Once again, this is another tutorial provided by Compete Now, WordPress and e-marketing tutorials. Give you the keys to WordPress and put you in fast success. 
definitely more on our website at starcompeting.com slash tutorials. Um, you can also subscribe to the channel or sign up for our weekly newsletter that um, you know updates you on new tutorials that have been added. All right.